Dollar Tree haul day. So I've just gotten out of my second Dollar Tree for the day. I found some new things. I found some things I didn't know about. I found some wish list items and I've got a pretty good size haul here. So I'm going to go ahead and get started with that. Um, wait a minute. Let me grab this because I have to go in Kohl's and actually I could put those back there. Okay. Maybe I'll leave it there. I've got to go in Kohl's and take those shirts back and like y'all know what shirts I'm talking about, right? Anyway, um, let's dig in. I'm excited. Got a few things. So I'm just gonna start off the top of this stack here. And um, number one is this right here. Now I have seen this before and I feel like I've actually bought this before. And hold on, let me turn this air, this heat off. Um, but I got this for my hubby because he's been going wild with his drill here lately the past couple of days. And today we're putting together a shelf. We're gonna have the drill out anyway. So I need this hanging on my wall to hang necklaces on because the ones that I got are so jam packed with necklaces that I can't even like dig through and pick out the necklaces. Like the ones in the back don't get wore as much because they're in the back and they're hard to deal with so like i just kind of get the ones in the front that i'm used to wearing and that's it but anyway i went ahead and grabbed this i'm gonna have him put that up for me later so i can organize some of my necklaces a little bit so oh gee whiz guys uh hold on dang okay the whole thing fell i don't even know is that even right is that what is that where we were are we recording okay we're going to go with it. Okay, so I grabbed another box of this cereal. It's the Space Jams cereal. And I grabbed this because I heard Jack telling her dad the other day not to eat all the Space Jam cereal because she liked it. So I went ahead and grabbed another. Probably should have got a couple more. Um, just because it's a good deal. It's a limited edition and $1.25 for a box of name brand cereal is a good deal. So grabbed those. And then I grabbed these because she is wanting to put some color in her hair. And why not? Because, because, why not? Um, so I got these three. She said she wants blue. So I feel like the blue won't show up a whole lot. It's just a semi-permanent. Um, I just got one of every one that they had. And then I'll let her, and I'm talking, when I say her, I mean Jack. Look at the bottom of this girl's hair, though. That purple, that is really pretty. So I'm going to let her pick out what color. And I'll probably do it this weekend, probably Sunday, so she can have nice, freshly colored hair for school on Monday. Totally. Why not, right? And then you guys probably think that I am absolutely out of my ever loving mind because I keep buying eyelashes. But every time I find a new pair, I've got to get them. That's, it's just, I have to. So this is a new line that they have out. And I, t and I even said the other day that it reminded me something about England. And this one right here is called High Tea. So look at the cute little box. It has little cherubs on it. See the back? They are Ioni, which is my absolute favorite eyelash ever. You can get 20, you can probably get 20 wears out of one pair of eyelashes if you take care of them, you know? Basically, you just have to pull that glue off. Like, after you wear them a few times, the glue kind of gets bunched up a little bit. But it'll, like, if you pull, it'll come straight off. And it's, like, brand new again. So, anyway, I got those right there. And then these right here is called Having a Ball look at those they are wow but the next ones i don't even know like i feel like they're so big i don't know they're, these are called hint of gold and i was trying to see is there a hint of gold but i don't see a hint of gold so i don't know why they're called hint of gold but they are a hint of huge if i can say like these bad boys are absolutely huge so how exciting though i love those I always get so excited when I see lashes, can I just say? And then I got me this right here just because I'm running around today doing videos, um, uh, going to Dollar Trees, and I needed a water with me, so I went ahead and I forgot to bring one. 
I'm actually going to coals because I have some coals cash I need to use and I'm gonna try to find a water filtration system for our um, sink so I can quit buying bottled water because too much of that crap goes to waste like between my son and granddaughter like almost full bottles all the time like I can't I can't deal with that so no more no more of that crap okay here in a minute I'm gonna show you what I ordered from Amazon um, it's this one thing in a package over here and I think it's interesting okay so check these out so this is the garden tool hanger so I did not realize that they had a garden tool hanger I thought that they just had like the one for the brooms and stuff um, and these are the garden tools and I have all of those so I got two of these and I'm gonna put them in the back hall by the back door and although this would be perfect for a garage our garage looks like hurricane Hugo hit it like that's the only one that entered my mind but anyway I love these and I love the ones that I have with my brooms on them like they're just cool they keep your broom out of the way and if everybody puts the broom back when they're done you always know where your broom is like it's, it's just that simple put it back when you're done and I think I'm gonna like we are gonna really work on our garage and try to get it man cavey ish for my husband cravey wavy so yeah um okay so i grabbed these and this is just from the um what is it just this green briar but this is the claw clips you get 12 in here and sometimes i like to pull like three or four or five parts of my hair back and just clip them up and these right here are perfect size for that i've actually been looking for these because i got them a long time ago and slowly but surely um they they end up getting lost one by one so i didn't really have a lot left so i went ahead and now i've got 12 i can start over with those and we'll see how long they last so and then I just got a two pack of the super glue. This is the glue that I use to put my nails on. I put these nails on, I know it was at least a week ago. I have not lost one single nail yet. So I am really, I don't know why, like that's really weird because usually I lose one or two nails, you know, and have to glue it back on and, and all that stuff, but not one nail has came off. So I'm, I'm up for that, but this is definitely a good deal. You get two for the price of one, and it's just the regular super glue. I always say yellow bottle with a red lid, and this is the bomb. That's the bomb nail glue. That's all I can say. Speaking of nails, I got those for Jack. Um, she loves wearing nails, and I honestly glue hers on too, just because, like, if I put them on like this with that sticky glue, that does not do anything. Like, before I'm even done putting them on, she will, they'll, they'll be one off. And, you know, she can't wear them to school and stuff. She likes to, you know, have her nails glued on the night before school and wear them to school to show all of her friends and stuff like that. So I do glue her nails on and usually they'll last a couple of days just because she's a little kid, you know. But anyway, I love these and I know she will too. And I ended up getting a couple more packs, which you'll see later. This is the culmination of two different stores. So yeah, um, this is something that I thought was cool and I really want to smell it. This is a limited edition Glade Cotton Cloud Dream. Check that out, Cotton Cloud Dream. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna roll my window down, spray it outside and see if it blows back in. It did. Mmm, it smells really good, I love it. Okay, so I'm really glad to find that. And the packaging, I just love the looks of the front of it. So, yes, I grabbed two of those. Let's see if I can balance everything. Okay, and then I saw this, which I had never seen before. So, oops, this is suave. When I saw it, it reminded me of like an Irish Spring bottle. Can you see that? Like, what'd you think? Maybe Irish Spring body wash, but it's not. But it is suave tea tree and hemp seed oil revitalizing conditioner it seems like whenever i find like a name brand or like something cool like this it's always the conditioner well except for that thicky thickening hair stuff that i found by i was gonna say pyrex but i know that's not right 
<laughs> but anyway, it's always the conditioner. So no shampoo, just the conditioner. It says with 100% natural tea tree and hemp seed oil. So no dyes, parabens, or something else. Um, salon proven quality, cruelty free, 100% vegan. So let's smell this stuff because that is really all that matters. Nah, not really. It's not all that matters, but you know, it does matter. Like, I always like a good smell in conditioner and shampoo. Oh my. Oh my. Can I just say, I love this. Like, this smells like, what is in this again? It smells like mint. Like, it's going to make your scalp tingle and feel really good. I love the smell. I absolutely, it smells like peppermint to me. I love the smell of this. I love it. So, yay. I love that. Okay. Next. Oh, okay, I'm just going to leave this here until I find the other one. I got this right here, and this is just the Value Health Aspirin. This is the low-dose low dose 81 milligram aspirins and you get 40 in here so this is in my vitamin regimen i posted a picture on instagram and also over on my other channel gypsies omad life and um, i showed like my vitamins so i do take a lot of vitamins a day and i just there's a crow it was like it was, it's like oh, oh a squirrel but oh a crow um it's looking at me like looking at me okay so anyway I take a lot of vitamins and I, I love to take my vitamins I do so somebody said that that's way too much but it's not way too much you know there's vitamins I take vitamins so I don't have to take over-the-counter I mean like prescription crap you know so there there there's that and then I got this and I don't know if this works or not and if you guys have used it, let me know. It's from Beauty Guru. It's Natural Eyelash Enhancing Serum with Castor Oil. So, I remember castor oil makes me think of being a kid. Like, if I said that I was sick and didn't want to go to school, I would have to take a dose of castor oil. Do you guys have, did you have to live through this trauma? I mean, am I the only one? Let me know. I'm just curious. Like, and I think it's because my mom knew that I was probably faking. And I probably was. Honestly, I probably was because I hated getting up early forever. I hate it now. I hate getting up early. I do. And like, that's the main reason why I quit high school. I did get pregnant in high school. And I quit high school, but I did end up going to college, get my GED, going to college. And I was like office manager in a couple of different doctor's offices and stuff. So I did, you know, I did further my education and make it count. But I did quit school. And the main reason why, I didn't want to get up early. And I could get away with it. So anyway, that's enough about me. Let's hear about you guys. Anyway, this is an eyelash serum. So... And I know, like, they have a lot of different brands, like Rodan and Fields, I think, has a brand of eyelash serum. Um, so, it comes with this little brush, you know, like the mascara brush. I know there's a name for that, but I can't think of it. And then, I'm going to give her a whirl, just because, I don't know, my eyelashes could use a little help. As we age, unfortunately, like, our hair thins. It does. Eyelashes hair on our legs, which I'm eternally grateful for, you know, um, it smells good, like it smells pleasant, so I don't know, I just thought I'd give it a whirl, let me know guys if you've tried this though, I'm just curious, I just need to know, I might have to move because the sun came out and I didn't think it was going to, so I parked like where I wanted, but unfortunately I may have to move if it stays out, okay. Because this thing will overheat and I'll lose all my footage. Okay, there's that bag, guys. Next. All right. Now, I do have a book giveaway going on right now. And if you've watched my last Dollar Tree haul, you know which book it is. Also, I polled over on TikTok about that. I don't know if I've gotten any subscribers from TikTok because of the book giveaway, but... Just letting you guys know, I'll be uh, picking that winner this weekend, and then I got three packages I need to mail out Monday, but after that, um, next week, I'm planning on doing the um, 
coloring book giveaway and I did find these coloring books in there so I got one for me and one for the giveaway let me just say these coloring books are the bomb.com it says cats okay and I was like before I've seen it before and I wasn't really even interested enough to pick it up but today I was looking at it I'm like that looks pretty interesting so let me look at it and let me just say there are some really really cute pictures of cats in here like they're kind of mandela ish where you have to color you know like more like you know a bunch of different colors which i'm all about anyway look at that one looking into goldfish bowl look at this one with the high heel shoe i love that and then there's one in here that i absolutely I mean, this is the front cover which i loved but there's one in here like when you say cat you don't think of lion right but boom look at that lion oh my gosh i would just love to color him all different colors doesn't he look majestic i love that so much so let me see if there's any more awesome oh kittens like look how cute i love that so anyway be on the lookout for a coloring book giveaway it may be by itself it may be in the middle of a Dollar Tree haul or who knows, some other type of haul too. So make sure you've hit that bell icon or that little bell button down below so you know when I upload videos. Okay, so I got me these stickers because they're pretty awesome. They are um, plants, like they're plants, but the containers are just like all colorful and I just thought they would really be cute in a planner or in a sticker book if you do a sticker book. I think that is really awesome. I think I'm going to get all my stickers out and a couple of those awesome little junk journal books and just me and Jack to sit down and make our own little sticker books. Yeah. Okay. So I ended up getting, and this was, this is a wish list probably from a year ago. People were hauling this and this is the first time that I had seen them and it's the Kodak batteries. They only had double A but you get five Kodak batteries. It says Kodak Super Heavy Duty Zinc. I don't know if they're any good or not, but I just feel like Kodak is definitely a name brand. So I really had to grab these because like I said, they have been on my wish list for a year at least, maybe more. I don't know, a, a year at least. And then my hubby is always telling me to get triple A batteries for his flashlights. So this is a four pack of the Panasonic triple A's. So I should just throw them in my purse because I'm always losing them. Cause I do have bags still I need to unpack at the house and yeah. Okay guys, here is something that I'm super excited about. I think I'm going to move the car first because the sun keeps trying to come out. I don't, I just, wait a minute. I see a big dark cloud coming, and if that cloud is coming this way, it might, I don't know. Hold on. Look, I'll be right back. Okay, guys. So, I moved, and I shouldn't be in the sun anymore. So, there we go. Now, this deal right here, let me just say, these are from iPlanet. A iPlanet Cellular Accessories, and this is USB wall chargers, number one. Check these out. These are name brand wall chargers. I'm always needing a box for something or, or another, something or another. I'm always needing a box, and I know that sometimes you can find these boxes in Dollar Tree, but like they're, you know, just like the E-Circuit brand, which is, you know, not the best brand on the planet. Um, not that this is, but this is a name brand, which I feel like is really cool. So anyway, I love finding the name brand stuff. So anyway, I grabbed two of those and they also have the car chargers, which this is just a single one. I think the one I have is a double and I think the one my hubby has is a double. But anyway, it's just a single one, but it says something about charging. Um, it says charges your phone device at the fastest possible speed. How cool. So anyway, that is a cool deal. So that is something I didn't know existed and I was super happy to find today. So yes, let me see here. Oh, my stomach is killing me. I don't know why. Okay, let's do this. Wait a minute, let me make a table here. That always helps. I can put a bunch of stuff on there. Okay, now 
Um, I grabbed two of the two more of these to put in my 17k giveaway because I had gotten me some, and then I'm like, you know what? These really are really good deals, and even people, you know, if you win the beauty giveaway, you may not like dark lipstick, you know, and this is just a light chapstick name brand, and I just thought that these, this color right here is really pretty, so I went ahead and grabbed two more um, for the giveaway, so yes. And then this is probably not the best deal ever, okay? It is the hand soap, it's the smaller size, but I had never seen zest like this in my life. I had just never seen this. So I feel like this is a good deal. And I opened it in there. It says fresh aqua. And I opened it in there and smelled it just because, you know, I've had a bad experience or two. And it smells very, very good. So anyway, I just got one just because, just to try it out. And because it's a name brand. And I have never seen it before. So yes. Okay. Next, I got this little pair of women's, it's from Juncture, they're shoe liners, and I like to wear these like with my Converse's, um, and I just, this print is just so flippin' adorable. So when I first saw this print, I thought they were flowers with eyes and stuff like that, but the more I look at it, the more I realize that it is like an owl. They're like three owls, because look at their little beaks, you can kind of see them. And I just think that they are just so cute. And yes, I'm, I'm always needing the shoe liners. And like, as long as they stay up on my heel, you know, and don't sink down in my soul, I'm good. And then Fifi is looking for stuff to hang at her office for St. Patrick's Day. So like I told her, I hadn't seen a whole lot of like stuff to decorate with or hang you know i got some of those little jellies with the little leprechaun the pot of gold i gave those to her um but this right here is going to be perfect for her to hang up at work it's not the cutest thing in the world but it is a decoration of for saint patrick's day so we'll take it she'll take it i'm sure and then i found this little sweetheart this is a bunny, and they had different ones, but the lady that was checking out in front of me got all they had. Like, she was, got there right before me, and she was loading them up, like, every one they had in her buggy. So, I don't really know what the deal with that was, but I'm like, okay. And luckily, I was able to get this one. So, anyway, it just says, Happy and Easter. It's the little gnome. I like the size of it. It's kind of skinny-ish, you know. It wouldn't take up much room on, like, a tape or, um, like, a, a, you could have, like, walls. Like, sometimes they're not wide as other walls. But anyway, I just thought it was cute, and it was a gnome. So, you know, you already know. I do have my receipt. So, if you are wanting to scan your receipts to earn you free gift cards, please let me know. I will send you my referral code, and you can get started Start saving for Christmas right now. Save for um, save for an Amazon gift card or something and use it for Christmas. That's a really good deal. Um, okay, so here's some food finds. Um, number one, I had been seeing the big jet puffed marshmallows at Dollar Tree, the big ones. And I just kind of passed on those because I'm like, well, you know, they're big. I don't know. But I saw the little ones today and I'm like, well, let me go ahead and get it because, you know, we have um, hot chocolate season still. It's still cold in winter. And so I think that's a good deal for a bag of Jet Puffed. Now, they smell amazing. So there's that. And then here's something new that I had never seen before. This is, check these out. Boom. Family size rice aroni. These are the beef. This is the only kind they had. But it just, it's a family size box. It's super big, 22 times more than regular size. So it's like the size of two boxes. So this is perfect for when I need a side dish for the family. So yes, I was super excited to see that. Yes, please. And then I got this. My granddaughter, Jack, um, is going to be staying the weekend over at her uh, great grandma's house like she normally does and I'll, and sometimes I try to get her some snacks sometimes Fifi does but I saw this and I'm like why not just grab it for her? it's birthday cupcakes and I figured she could have one and give one to Gigi right 
So anyway, I'm going to try not to bury that up somewhere. And then, um, boom, baby is all I can say. This is my favorite gum. It smells absolutely amazing. Um, every night, I have to have three pieces and blow bubbles, and that's just the way it is. Like, this is my treat myself thing, you know? Watermelon gum, sugar-free. Okay, and then here's something I've never seen. So, these are the Lipton. Check these out. Lipton drink mixes. So these make one pitcher, and I've got the perfect pitcher. Um, so there's no artificial colors, flavors, or sweeteners. They have three different kinds. This is the um, okay, so it's saying I don't want to butcher that. I'm not butchering. I'm not even going to say it. I'm not even going to attempt. Um, but it is hibiscus lime. I do know that part. Um, Jamaica and lime flavored. So hibiscus lime. Um, it says sweetened with pure cane sugar. So all that Jamaica. Jamaica? Is that like the... Never mind. I'm, I'm just going to get myself in trouble. So there's that one. Hibiscus lime. And then they have this one here, which is pineapple mango. And my son is going to love these. I'm pretty sure of that. And then this one is horchata, which is funny because I had never heard of the name horchata until like about a month ago. And my hubby's going to be cracking up at this one too. So anyway, and this one looks kind of like cream soda-ish. If anybody knows like what horchata is, let me know. Because like I'm 53, like, and I've never heard that word ever until here recently. Even if I, it, 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 even, I mean, I might not even be saying it right. A horchata, is that even right? I don't know. So anyway, let me know what that tastes like or what it's supposed to be. Just out of curiosity. Okay, let's move over here to what's in here. Okay, so I got a few more little Eastery things. Number one, I got me two towels to hang on my um, kitchen cabinets, which they're super cute. Look at that. Look how colorful that is. Like that is so cute and colorful. I love it. And then the eggs. So I think these are both really cute hand towels. I will use them to hang as decor. Definitely. And then they had these super cute napkins. Like this one, but I feel like they used to give more napkins. I don't know. You get 14 now. But this one here says it's all about the journey. And I love these for springtime. I love the bike with the flowers in it. So cute. It's all about the journey. This one is my fave. So this one just says be positive. Look how cute that bee is. I love these. So these are just, you know, to hang around for springtime. Just with dinner and stuff like that, you know. Okay, here's the other nails that I got for Jack. So I got her these right here, and which are the LOL ones, which is super cute. She'll love those. I don't know what I did with the other ones. Oh, yeah, they're there. Oh, let me just put them together. And then I got these right here, which are, I don't, are these, it says the Adore brand. These are press-on nails, which I'll still use super glue. You get 10 in here. These just say super sweet. So I think these are really, really cute. So, yeah, she's going to love those. Okay, next, I got her a pack of socks and me a pack. Now, she got three pairs of socks in hers. So, I love the unicorn. It says love. I love the colors of the unicorn. And then the second pair is just like solid pink. And then the last pair is like this gorgeous rainbow color, which I absolutely love. And like I've said before, she is always needing socks for sure. And then me, I, I picked these up, I looked at them, and I put them down because I'm like, you only get two pair. And I was thinking you used to get three pair in women's, but I don't know. But these are so cute, guys. Like, I could not pass them. I had to pick them back up and, and get them. They're little snails. Now, isn't these the cutest little snails that you've ever seen? I love them. I just absolutely love them. And on the toes, it says, snailed it. 
also snailed it. And then I love this pair too, honestly. I love this pair. I love the pink and the gray together, stripies. Yes, love those. Okay. And then I got these just in case I decide to do like a, um, an Easter like flower arrangement or something. You can even really stick these in the garden. I think they'd look super cute. Although they are like made out of twine, but they're really good size. So I think they're just super cute. So anyway, they would look really cute in a flower arrangement though, honestly. And then I got this for Jack. I don't know why, because she already has too much crap, but I couldn't resist it because I know how much she loves her kitty cats. And I just thought this was absolutely adorbs. <laughs> Look at this. They had this color in blue. And what a cute trinket tray. Like, how cute is that? Right now, her room is a disaster, and I'm wanting to fix it up again, like, for the 50th time, right? But, like, just to have that for, you know, I don't know. I don't know what she would even put on it, but I know she's going to love it. So, yeah. And then I got two movies because I thought they looked good. One of them is kind of bouncing around in here, which is not a good thing. Um, this one is called Broken Swords, which, you know, I'm all about, like, that type of sword fighting. And, and I just, this just looks really good to me. Um, broken Swords. So, it says, a war rages between the frost giants of the joy realm of something and the sky-worshipping tempters of Samada. It just looks like a, a really good female lead, maybe, character. I just love it. So, I'm like, I'm, I'm going to watch that. And then this one says, Witches in the Woods. And... It just looked good to me, so I grabbed that too. Okay, there's that. All right, let me show you guys some signs that I picked up, and I have one more receipt. What I do with my other one? Message me if you want if you want the code. Um, and then this right here is the one that I picked out, the long one. So this is just says Happy Easter. Happy's on top. The bunny's cute, but I did see a cute pink one in there that was really probably cuter than this one. And then they had these two, which I fell in love with. Like, these are really cute. Look at these. This one has the real, like, tin bunny on it, and this one has, like, a fake tin bunny, which I thought was funny. But I love the real one best. Like the green one or the blue one is the prettiest to me. I love the Easter eggs on this one though. I just thought they were cute and I got these to share with BP. And then, so they had these right here as well. And I only got one of these. And obviously, you know, it's the truck. So I had to get one. So I just think that's really cute. It says, Happy Easter. You got the bunny butt sticking out. The pink truck. And the lady said they did have blue ones, but the blue ones went really fast. Which, okay. I at least got me a pink one, right? Super cute. Okay. Now, I'm going to stop right here. I've got two more bags right here, but I'm wanting to save them because... I got two bags in the back, and if I put these with those, that'll be the perfect amount for another Dollar Tree haul. So anyway, I just want to say, well, number one, I want to show you this this that I got off of Amazon. So I just want to say that tomorrow, me and Fifi are going to two. We're going to vlog all day long. We are going to go to two um, Goodwills, one in Oak Hill and one in Summersville. So, a little bit of traveling, um, and then we're going to go to three Dollar Trees. So, I should get some of my stock back up a little bit, but honestly, I haven't been finding as much stuff at the Dollar Tree as usual. So, anyway, be watching for that. We'll do a vlog. Um, we may do the Goodwill haul with that, or it could be a separate video. I don't know. So, anyway, let me show you what I ordered off of Amazon. You guys know, I'm always talking about stuff like this, and I thought, why not order a book about it? So, I just want to start getting me a collection of books. You guys are going to think I'm crazy, but I just want to say, I'm not crazy. It's this. It's the Bigfoot book, Encyclopedia of Sasquatch, Yeti, and Cryptid Primates. So, 
I absolutely believe in Bigfoot. I do. And I know all the skeptics are like, you know, what, like, how come one's ever been found or anything like that? Well, I don't know. And I can't explain that. But I just want to say, I believe in Bigfoot, okay? So, hold on a minute. There's a guy over here just standing right beside the passenger side door. All right, he went on. But anyway, I ordered that, and I'm super excited to get into it. It says, Legendary, Lurking, and Notoriously Elusive. And I'm just super excited. I can't wait to read it. And I'm just going to get me a collection of Bigfoot books. Sasquatch, just, you know, just, uh, just a collection. Just because I love, it's something that I love, I'm interested in. We watch documentaries all the time. And every time we go in the woods, we have our eyes peeled because one of these days, baby, I just hope I'm not by myself when I see him. <laughs> that would be a little much. But anyway, just wanted to show you guys this and or all, the, all these goodies. Let me know what your favorite item was from today. I'm just curious. Let me know. And until next time, guys, bye.